If your Xbox Series X console is stuck on green screen and it won't boot up, maybe the screen is flickering green and you have tried rebooting it or turning it on or off and it's still the same, then don't worry and follow these simple steps that can help your Xbox get out of green screen. When your Xbox is stuck on green screen, the first thing that you should do is try cold booting or power cycling it. You'll need to shut down your Xbox and then unplug its power cord. You should also remove any external or USB storage that's connected to your console. After that, wait for at least 5 minutes and it's even better if you can wait half an hour. After that, turn your Xbox back on and see if it's fixed. If the green screen still appears, then you'll be surprised to know that sometimes it's caused by your TV and not your Xbox console. To check that, turn up your TV's volume and now move around your Xbox console using the controller and check if you can hear something. As you can see, we can hear the login sound, which means our Xbox is working properly, but the screen is just green. So to fix this, you can try power cycling your TV and also some have suggested that resetting your TV's picture settings also helps. If you're still getting green screen and you're in doubt, then you can also try connecting your Xbox X console to a different TV or a monitor. After following these steps, if the problem persists, then we'll resume troubleshooting our console. In this step, first we'll turn off our Xbox console completely by holding down the Xbox button. And after that, we'll unplug its power cord, wait for 30 seconds, then plug it back in. Now we'll boot it up in troubleshooting mode or safe mode. To do this, you'll need to hold down the eject and pair button together and while holding them, press the power button. Keep holding the two other buttons until you hear the second startup time. Now you should see the troubleshoot menu. From here what you need to do is first turn on your controller, then go to reset this Xbox using the D-pad and now we'll try resetting the Xbox while keeping our games and apps intact. You'll just need to sign in once again. And after resetting it, your Xbox should no longer display the green screen. If it fails and you're still stuck in green screen, then you have two options left. Either come back here and reset and remove everything, or you can also use an external USB to perform an offline system update on your Xbox console. And we have a separate video on how to set up a USB to update your Xbox. And after that, the green screen will go away for good. So make sure to let us know how it went and which step worked. Drop a like, subscribe, and I'll see you around.